Hello guys, today we got cave dwelling. Holy smokes, this looks scary as fuck. We decided to bring along Charlie, the Dilo. He's our highest level Dilo, and um, we can get quite a bit of experience and gear from this cave. Um, I've not brought anything important with me just because we may die and I learned the hard way yesterday because I lost Klaus the raptor um, he fell off a ledge and I couldn't find him um, he, I think he went into some freaking puddle or something but anyway that's the past I'm over it and we're on to a new adventure with Charlie and I've decided to bring my bow and arrow just because these little bastards are a hard thing to kill you're really just gonna sit there why you gotta do a better job than that freaking Charlie Fuck's sake. <sighs> this happened to me yesterday. It's looking like I need to bring a bigger dino army. But then again, Charlie seems to be doing a job on the scorpion, so I should wake up in a minute. If uh, it's not looking like it. No. Charlie, you failed me. Big time. Big time failed me. Uh, but that's alright. Because he'll stay there now. So all I'm going to do is run over. What I might do is... Is there any dinos? I really need a raptor. I'm gonna have to train another raptor, guys. I really am. Oh, we got this guy as well, the psycho. Big monstrous dude, but we haven't got a mount for him yet, so we can't use him just yet. Which is rather frustrating. But it's looking like Charlie's surviving. It's a bit laggy because I'm uploading videos at the same time. Um, not the best ideas to do, but you know, I'm doing it. Um, yeah, I've done quite a lot of recordings, so I'm just trying to get them out there for you guys. Show you what you've been missing. I've also learnt quite a bit about blueprints. Um, this here, if you highlight it, it says storm pick. But pickaxe I'm actually using is called a ramshackle pickaxe which is um, the third best it goes standard primitive ramshackle and the ramshackle it's quite damn efficient at collecting resources from any resource really um, from meat in the caves to trees so I'm trying to get a pick and um, a hatchet. I did have one, but I lost it in this cave, like an op. And um, I had an apprentice hatchet, which was freaking amazing. We collected wood, like no tomorrow. We collected stone, like God knows what. Um, so I'm trying to find another one by just cave dwelling, which is easier said than done. Let's see. He should be down here somewhere, my little friend. Oh, he's there. He's alive. He's a beauty. And look at all that. Look what he's collected. He's collected pr raw prime meat, a recipe, a slingshot, more stone arrows, chitin. Just, just pure legend. Right, let's. Didn't mean to do that then. Yeah. 
transfer our, oh no cancel take all items and then stick our armor back on and get that back out eat some berries can do is take half of that off him and I think I'm going to place my campfire where it lets me doesn't look like it is going to, I should have known that right, so what I'm going to do is set to Attack my target. There we go. Just because he didn't seem to attack him when I told him to, then. The scorpions are the real pain in the ass. Why aren't you attacking him? See, it's the sort of shit that I'm talking about. Doesn't help that I'm lagging. You're right. Ah, oh, I've just killed it as well. Typical. Um, what I should do is equip some freaking stim berries. But this is this is an epic fail of cave dwelling. As you can see, my top is rising and rising. I've got to wait for it to stop flashing before it starts going down. So I'll be back with you in a second. Right, as you can see, the torpidity the stars to the right has gone back down now. It's going down slowly but surely, and we will wake up in a couple of seconds. And there we go. Also, what else I've learned is you see how it's saying decomposes in whatever and don't say it's got an inventory. Well if you if it pops up like it would do like that on our dialogue, it then means that you can basically take something off it. It'll be holding something like recipes, gear, all sorts of different stuff. Right, there's a spider there. Okay, there's a few of them. There we go, we killed one. So that one's not got one either, so we'll just loot him. And as you can see, you get plenty of meat from these places. I was expecting our dialogue to do better, but apparently not. Being poisoned actually means that your stamina goes down. How are you doing for health? He needs to rest a bit. As do I. Why don't you eat one of the prime meats, dude? Be good for you. probably do with increasing his weight so we can carry more but we need to actually eat something as well I 
next time we go cave dwelling guys I think we'll probably tame two raptors how are you doing for hell he's on his way back up there's a titan bow down here which is what we really want to kill looking like we may lose the dialer here if I'm honest I don't know if I keep them on me come on shitty lag killed a level 52 Freaking irritating. Oh, hang on. See, this is what I'm talking about. We have some more stone arrows for us. He's got some stim berries as well as regular berries. A hatchet, which we do actually need. I'm just going to take it all from that inventory. Well, wherever our dialo is, it's still going. He's there, he's fighting. Level 116. He's holding his own against it. No, we lost Kevin. I killed him. What a freaking idiot I am. I've got a fucking Titan Bowler. Bollocks. Titan boys are so unpredictable. Killed him. There's no inventory to him either. The remains of Spike. And take all from inventory. Sorry, Spike. Oh, well, sorry, Charlie, I should say. Right. We've learned the lesson the hard way, though. We've lost a dino. So the next time we're going to bring in some raptors. But I mean, we got quite a bit from it. Oh, some in, something inside here. Oh no, I've already took it. So let's harvest the arachnid. There we go, we leveled up as well. I've been pumping a lot into weight as you can probably see. Um, but um, what could we do with pumping something into? Probably health. Got 25 points. 
at level 30. You could probably do with learning. Simple pistol. A simple bullet, maybe. I know you say it takes a lot of metal for that though. Um, I'm going to start learning the chitting stuff because it will help out quite a bit when we're down here. And I'll learn the metal pike as well. Right, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here while we still can. Actually, don't even know where I'm going with that. This is a metal rock. This is the sort of rock you get metal from. You can tell by the goldenish colour it's got to it. And as you've just seen, we've got quite a bit of uh, metal from that one. Da -da -da -da. Right, guys, I'm going to end this episode here. A um, bit of insight of into cave dwelling for you. I was hoping to show you a few differences in the blueprints, but I didn't get a chance to, so keep an eye out for that one in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed watching. Don't forget to like, share, sub, and comment. Letters.